1989. What does that mean to me? <laughs> it was the year I was born. It means a lot to me. I've been on a journey, per se, trying to figure out some things in life. I went to go see Candyman today and I really enjoyed it. <laughs> I really did. The co-writer and director of that movie, Nia DaCosta, is just making moves and I'm so proud of her. But the reason why I bring the year of my birth up is because it's also the same year she was born as well. She's a couple of months younger than me. <laughs> she is... I believe the second, no, I believe she's the first black female director to have a number one, well, have a film open at number one in the box office. And I'm just, like, amazed by that. Also, am excited to see her new film next year. <laughs> She's uh, directing uh, the sequel to Captain Marvel, The Marvels, and. I'm just in awe of what she has accomplished. I really am. I um I'm inspired by her. <laughs> I don't think I'm good enough. And I'm not the only person that has that feeling. I, I, I don't think I'm good enough. Hmm. I've been rejected, dejected so many times. But I know that I have something. There's a reason why I'm still here. <laughs> I mean, seriously, there... I've been down the road of you know, suicidal tendencies and thoughts. And while that's long gone, it's just a question of what do you do? Because the job that I'm doing right now is something I don't want to do anymore. I just want better for my life. I think we all do. These are happy thoughts, but it's also my truths. And I have to put them out there on the universe. I just, I want better. So, Nia DaCosta, thank you. <laughs> you have no idea how much you inspired me today to do something that I enjoy doing. And so, I can't wait to create more um, 
I'm going to enjoy these couple of days off. I actually have a couple of days off from work. So, starting September 1st, you will be receiving some new things. I don't know what it's going to be, but it's just going to be me just creating something. I'm tired of going about life the wrong way. I'm not tired of playing with my hair because <laughs> uh, just, I guess me just pulling on my hair, I guess feels good. Is, is that awkward? Yeah, that's awkward. <laughs> um, but whatever it is, I'm just, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna wing it. I'm gonna keep pushing. I'm gonna do better, be better, whatever. I love you guys. I just, I want better. And this feels good saying it out loud. I just want better. And I. Yeah. I just keep marinating on this. And I'm not going to stop marinating until something becomes positive and it's a new change. Whatever the change is, I just. It feels good saying that out loud. And to see other people doing something that works for them. So. I love you guys. Thank you for rocking with me. Um, you'll see what comes next. I'm excited. Hopefully it'll be positive. You know, everybody starts from the bottom and work their way up. So, hopefully I'll be one of those people. So, in closing, this is Courtney Reese. Reminding everyone to love one another. And no matter what life may bring you, never forget, be wise, be inspired, be intelligent, but most importantly, be you, be inspired. Please be inspired. And just go forth on an idea. But have common sense with that idea, because I know some of you people will go forth on ideas and knowing damn well it's not the right thing, but I love you all, and I just pray that you guys do something successful and just be careful. So take care and I will see you guys soon. Peace.